everybody that that needed to be there was there. You don't want to understate the possibility that, that things could go really bad. Dale Earnhardt will come to the caution flag to win the Daytona 500. With the number three, 20 years ago, 20 years of trying for Earnhardt, he won the Daytona 500. Austin Dillon win. You know, he waiting for Dale to come in. And so that pretty much told me that, um, you know, the celebration was over. Michael Waltrip drove to the winner's circle to celebrate victory in the 2001 Daytona 500. How could he have known that the seminal moment of his career would be forever shrouded in tragedy? Larry McReynolds, for the second time in this great race, will go to victory lane, once with the late Davy Allison and today with Earnhardt. What was begin beginning to be more and more odd is no Earnhardt was there. Richard Childress, you have tried so hard, so long, you have done it. What is it like to finally win the Daytona 500? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You know, this team this year, we took all winter, and I just I can't say enough about Dale Earnhardt, Jim Goodwrench has stood behind, and most of all, our race fans. Unbelievable. Check the bottom. Check the flag right here. Big wreck in your mirror. Holy Big Andy's wife works, she worked at the Halifax Hospital in the emergency room. She had called him and told him to get DW and get down here. And I remember thinking, where's Dale? I mean, how come he's not here yet? And Dale Jr., how come he's not here? I, I, I'm sure they're coming, right? I'm extremely worried about Dale. And you can tell by the people around the, the, the car, even though it was in a long shot. Well, I was going to go to Victory Circle, but my friend Andy uh, Kespacito, he's a deputy sheriff, he was going to take me down through the crowd to get to Victory Circle. So when I, when I take off the headset and I turn around, he's standing at the top of the stairs shaking his head. That was such an important uh, moment for him. I love Mikey like a brother, and I wanted to tell him what I thought the deal was. By then, I'm, I don't know what to do. I'm wanting to go to Victory Circle, but I don't know if I should. I have his son standing next to me. There's nobody in this room. So... I take care of him. Actually, he had no favorite driver, and I told him, I said, I'll give you my hat if you if I'm your favorite driver. Dale Earnhardt Jr., he quickly gets away. Rookie or veteran, no matter how long you've been coming to this event, there are butterflies. There have to be. A lap of honor for Jimmy Johnson as he starts his final full season. I have never been so excited for the start of a 500 as yesterday and never so disappointed. Back, they're wrecking big time on the front stretch. They're wrecking big, wrecking big. Big wreck in front of me, big wreck, big wreck, big wreck. Oh my God, I don't know where I finished, but he went right above me. You all right, buddy? You okay? Yeah, I'm good. Wow. Talk to me when you can, buddy. Talk to me when you can, buddy. All the people were in the way, I can't, I can't see. Let's try to push the six on the block. I guess I'm turning them. Have they heard from filming yet? No. Yeah. 
Good job, guys. Congrats. Congrats, man. And the ambulance was traveling virtually at walking pace, which meant either a broken back or death. Safety has come a long way in this sport, um, but sometimes we are reminded that it uh, is a very dangerous sport, and we just uh, thoughts and prayers right now are with Ryan Newman and his family. I can't remember everyone that was in the room, but whoever came in, I think it was a doctor, came in and said, we lost Dale. 